Hi everybody, today I'll show you how to add buy now button in WooCommerce shop page and single product page. So let's just begin. Alright, so the first thing that we need to do here is to go inside the plugins and click on the add new plugin. And here we have to search for direct checkout for WooCommerce. And as you can see here, we have our plugin at the top of the search. So we have to install this. Now we have to click on activate. All right. So now I will need to refresh the page. So first we will go to our shop. So let's click on visit store. And now you'll be able to see that we have add to cart button here. And if I click on the product page, you will be able to see we have add to cart button. So now what we need to do, we have to change this to buy now. Okay, so how can you do this? We'll simply go back and here you can see the WooCommerce. We have to click on direct checkout. So in the direct checkout, as you can see here, we have the different options. So we have the journal settings, we have archives, we have products, checkout, premium, documentation and suggestions. Okay, so in the journal, you can see this. We have add to cart alert. We have add to cart link in the shop. And we have add to cart redirect and in the last we have replace cart URL. So we're going to simply enable all of these options here to yes. So this would be also yes. And this would be also yes. So now we have a new option added to cart redirect to. Now we have to select where should we redirect when we click on add to cart. So I would like to change this to checkout. Okay directly. So when I click on the add to cart now it will directly take me to the checkout page. Okay, so let's just save changes. Alright, so now what we'll do, we we'll simply go inside the archives. So in archives, what we need to do, we have to check the first option that is replace add to cart text that we need to change. Alright, and here we will simply write down buy now text. Okay, so let's click on save changes. And after this, we have to go inside the products. So in the products, as you can see here that we have four different options. So the first one is add adjex add to cart that we will ignore for the moment. And the second one is replace add to cart text that we want to do. So I just simply change this to yes first. And after this, I will be able to have the option to replace add to cart text content. So this will also be by now text. And after this, you can see here we have the option of add a quick purchase button and also the default attributes but they are disabled by default so let's click on save changes all right so after this we have checkout so let's click on the checkout so in checkout you will be able to see multiple different options okay so you can also change the checkout field so if you wanted to remove the checkout fields you can simply add those fields here and you can also remove the checkout shipping address and after that you can see the option of order command and checkout policy text so if you want to remove any of these options you can simply change this from no to yes okay and after this we have checkout terms and condition and in the last we have the gateway icons okay but right now we don't have to do anything with the checkout so that is why we won't be doing any change into it so now I simply go back to our shop and now you will be able to see that instead of add to cart button, we are having buy now button. Okay. So this is on the shop page. So if I just click on the buy now, it will simply redirect us to the checkout directly without going into add to cart page. Okay. So that is a kind of grateful sales. Okay. So now we're going to go to our product page. So I would basically refresh the page. Now you'll also be able to see that on our product page, we are having buy now button. So we have simply replaced add to cart button into buy now button with the help of direct checkout in WooCommerce plugin. So if you really find this video useful, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel.